We were at, and you're here to talk about the uh, Missoula Symphony Orchestra. You guys have a concert this weekend, so please tell us more. Yes, we have our uh, concert. It's called Autumn Glow. Uh, it takes place uh, this Saturday at 7.30, Sunday at 3 p.m. Uh, it's a, a concert featuring a wonderful pianist. Her name is Lisa Smirnova. She comes to us all the way from Austria, from Vienna. And being Austrian, she's very much into the music of Mozart. And this is what we're presenting with her. It's a real treat to work with an expert on this particular repertoire. Uh, Mozart, you know, he wrote music more than 220, 30 years ago when this piece was written. If you don't have the same approach playing this music, it can get a little boring. But with her, it never is. It's always very exciting. It comes to life, and it's really a treat to work on it. Uh, in addition, we're performing a very autumnal piece, Brahms's Fourth Symphony, hence the, the title, Autumn Glow. Um, and that's uh, one of the great works for orchestra and a real treat to prepare this week uh, with the ensemble. Cool. You guys tend to have a theme every year for the Missoula Symphony Orchestra. What is your theme this year? Uh, generally, as every year, we, we try to explore uh, the best uh, of orchestral music that, that's there to offer. And each piece uh, that we perform is programmed in such a way to give contrast across the season. So our first concert, for example, we presented music of Debussy, La Mer, very uh, uh, French, early 20th century style. Here we go into the Romantics with uh, Brahms and then, um, you know, uh, classical concerto in the first half. Next concert will be a Mozart uh, C minor mass, which is big choral work. So always something different. And uh, the idea is that our audience is every, every uh, show that they come, they see really what's best of orchestral music that we have. That's our, our mission. And how do you guys find your soloists? How do you pick them out? Uh, generally, it's word of mouth uh, in the industry. It's uh, personal contacts. Um, yeah, it just kind of depends. Each case is a little different. And so why did you guys choose her for this concert? Um, specifically, this aspect of her approach to Mozart. It's, um, uh, like I said, if you just play the music through, it can get a little dull. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's very, very lively playing, what she brings to it. Yeah. Let's uh, talk a little bit more about her. Um, like, what, what, I mean, what did she? Who did she play with most of the time? And so, one of the big things with Lisa. This is really a, a soloist of international stature. Uh, she's performed um, in the greatest Viennese halls in the Concertgebouw in Amsterdam. She's the winner of the 2012 uh, Recording Prize by the BBC. So, it's really a high-profile so soloist for us to be able to bring in. And um, I'm, like I said, I'm. I'm that's another part of our mission is to be able to present soloists like this in Missoula, to bring it to our community and to really show uh, the best artists on the classical music scene today to bring them to our town. And so where can people find out more information about that? And about so uh, the best place is our website, missoulasymphony.org. Uh, tickets are available. Uh, they range from $10 and up. There's a general admission uh, section on Sunday, which is nice because you can choose uh, whatever seat you'd like to sit in. Uh, but um, in general, the, the website is a good place to, to start. You can also call us, 721-3194. Um, and uh, yeah, I look forward to seeing people this weekend. Nice. Yeah. And so how can people buy tickets? Um, so directly online, you, you yeah. can buy tickets. Or if you'd like, you can visit us at the office or uh, call us. What's yeah. the price range? Uh, $10 and up. Is there anything else you want to say? Just I'm really excited about this weekend. I'm excited about working with the orchestra all year long. You know, it's really a treat to be able to work with guest artists and on this type of repertoire. Um, one note to uh, to keep in mind is that the Missoula Symphony Holiday Show is coming up the first weekend of December. Um, that's been so popular, has actually sold out often a month in advance. So now we've added the third show. Uh, so it's going to be Saturday and then two shows on Sunday, a matinee and an evening performance. So um, if if you're looking for tickets, this is a thing to think about now. Right. Yeah. Awesome. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, so once again, Adarko Buderat and the Missoula Symphony Orchestra is doing Autumn Glow, which is happening this weekend, October 29th, 7.30 p.m., and then on Sunday at 3 p.m. Very good. All right. So if you want more information, you can go to missoulasymphonyorchestra.org. Missoulasymphony.org. Yep. Uh, thanks for joining us, and we'll be right back right after this. <laughs>